everyone's pretty familiar with Judy Garland, but maybe not what this film Judy is going to bring. So what can people expect? Um, I think I, I mean, I think everyone's familiar in a certain way uh, with Judy Garland, but um, people don't know the, the behind the scenes. I think you see a real tenderness in this uh, with her. It's not just the big performance. There's something underneath that, and it's what happens when you go off stage. Uh, and I think I was drawn to it, especially because as an actor, when you, when you go off stage and when you go off camera, those are the moments, you know, people just see this, but it's about the backstage and it's about the, the intimacy of that. And I think you really see it in this, uh, this film. And what can you tell us about your character and your role in the film? And what drew you to playing this role? Uh, so I play Burt Rhodes. He is uh, the musician at the Talk of the Town Club. You're getting wet there, right? <laughs> He's, um, he's a musician at the Talk of the Town Club, which is the new Hippodrome Casino in Leicester Square. Um, that's where all the big stars used to come and play with his band. Um, and he was kind of the silent hero. I mean, he, he, was, he was always behind the scenes. He didn't take the limelight, but people said they loved working with him. He was a musician's musician. And uh, I loved him for that, you know? He just helped and he, he provided what needed to be provided. And um, that was what kind of drew me to the role, really. It wasn't, it wasn't an obvious part to play. Renee Ritzelweger really seems to become Judy Garland. I mean, what was it like working with her? And, and, and what do you think she drew from, the, from this character and made such a big part of the film? I think uh, she's, an, uh, she's an amazing person, first and foremost, and she's an amazing actor. That's, that's a given. But uh, she's so honest and, and welcoming as an actor. Um, and I think she, she, she inhabits the character so well. And I think she, uh, you see it in the performance. I mean, she's... She's a consummate pro, but we had a lot of fun on this movie too. And she made, you know, when you're first on the call, she, you know, you don't just, you're not just the lead. You have to lead the whole team. And she did it in a, in a beautiful, beautiful way. And it's quite a damning indictment of the impact of Hollywood on, on people's lives and particularly women. Do you think it's got something to say to today and how have things changed, do you reckon? I think absolutely. It's, it's incredibly relevant. And I think that's all why, a, a real big, big part of why we wanted to tell the story. Um, I think things are changing. I think things are being uh, brought to the, the public eye. Uh, I think there's a long way to go, though, especially for women, especially for uh, minorities. All of, this, all of these things are changing slowly, um, but I think we're moving in the right direction, for sure. Can you quickly tell us what you'll do next? Um, I have an amazing project coming up. Uh, I can't tell you anything, but it's going to be announced in the next couple of weeks, so uh, look out for it. Amazing. Can't wait. Thanks for your time. Congratulations on the film.